the action on the floor is considerably less than you'd expect to see from a political convention, that's because we're not at the political convention. It's more than just that laughing cavalier outsider kind of thing to which Countdown strives. As you'll notice now from our special co uh, convention correspondent, Brian Baltazar, we also couldn't get tickets. It's a beautiful day in Boston, and outside the Fleet Center, there's excitement about the great things that will happen inside. That is, if you're one of the people who can actually get inside. I'm what you might call a convention outsider. I decided to come up here last week. Since I'm not a real journalist, I never told anybody I was coming. Keep a can, can just the average person just get in there? Keep a you're being abundantly clear. <laughs> you're not even talking to me, are you? If I had, say, like a, a former president with me. You got a former president with you? How about like, you know, like George Washington? Oh, no, no, no. Turns out, the average person isn't getting anywhere near the Fleet Center. It isn't long before I realize my dreams of getting in on the DNC action and meeting John Kerry are fading. Until moments later, when I meet the John Kerry impersonator. Suddenly, here I am interviewing the John Kerry impersonator. Um, first of all, what's your favorite album? Uh, the White Album. Abbey Road. What branch of the military did you serve in? Uh, Army. Uh, the Navy. Okay, his name is Tom DeCesare, and what he lacks in knowledge of Kerry trivia, he makes up for in looks. -da 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 -da. And some of the passers-by are falling for it. Yes, I am. My family is number one. During his political jammering, I start to wander off, and in those moments, I'm in the inner circle hobnobbing with John Kerry, spending time together, laughing, doing what good friends do. Maybe I can fit into this political scene. Determined to fit in, I decide to attend New York's delegation party. Held at the L Street bathhouse, I have no problems getting in. Let's party! Unfortunately, not only am I inappropriately dressed, I'm also three hours late. Do you need help cleaning up? I'm beginning to realize that the Democratic Convention is pretty much a five-day private party, and I'm not invited. But there are stories out there, and I'm going to find them, even if it is from the outside. For Countdown, I'm Brian Balthazar. Brian, thanks. Nice slippers. Still ahead of us.